Hey guys, Naisha here. Since I've been feeling nostalgic lately, I figured why not revisit my top 10 favorite Muppet Baby songs. This video was done years ago when I had one channel, which I have now turned into gaming. If you're a fan of the show, don't hesitate to leave a comment below, or put a like on the video to help spread the word on an iconic cartoon. Without further ado, enjoy the video. Inspired by the live-action dream sequence from the Muppets Take Manhattan, Muppet Babies is a cartoon show about our favorite characters as babies. I won't dwell into the awesomeness of the show too much as it will be a review in itself. But to me, one of the most memorable things about the show were their songs. Some were catchy, others were sweet, while others, well, could have been less self-centered. But I love their songs. So I'm going to show you my top 10 favorite songs from the Muppet Babies. Number 10, Ralph Gang, I'm a Doggus. From the episode Fozzie's Family Tree, the gang take a look at their ancestors to learn more about who they are. In this segment, Ralph finds his ancestor, Ralph Gang, I'm a Doggus, trying to come up with a piece for a performance. With a little help from his predecessor, he learns a little bit of rock and roll. This was one of my songs that can be catchy and sometimes surprises you when you're not thinking about it. Alright! Number 9. Look a little bit closer. From Beauty and the Schnoz. We all know Gonzo had a thing for Miss Piggy. And in this episode, he tries to win her heart as always, but for once, her attention is not on Kermit. What's nice is that it teaches you not to judge a book by its cover. What might not be attractive on the outside is beautiful on the inside. Number 8. Sleep Rockin' from Noisy Neighbors. This was the very first episode, two months after the Manhattan movie. The babies are making noises while their next door neighbor who works at night is trying to get some sleep. So now the babies are trying to find ways to keep things quiet. Especially the lovable yet noisy animal. I like this episode because it reminds me of the live action sequence because of the way the animation flows. Number 7. Musical Muppets Ralph gets a letter to enter a songwriting contest and the others pitch in creating their own songs Seeing that there were various songs the episode was fun to watch because of the variety of songs So I couldn't really just pick one and it was creative when they successfully were able to combine it together This episode also taught me how to MacGyver a tape cassette when it unravels or rips and believe me It works if you haven't tried it Number 6, Superhero Opera, from Sing a Song of Superheroes. Nanny's water is shut down and the babies use their imagination to look for water, singing various songs from classic operas. Just like musical Muppets, it's fun to hear everyone singing different songs. And of course, who doesn't love Gonzo in a Batman outfit? I Number 5. I'll Be Blue For You from Faster Than a Speeding Weirdo. It's a Gonzo episode where Gonzo goes too far in his crazy schemes and gets his stuffed toy chicken Camilla torn open. As Nanny tries to mend her, Gonzo goes to Mars. Yes, Mars, to wish her well. This song is sweet because Gonzo is a favorite of mine. Number 4, I Can't Help Being a Star, from Gonzo's Video Show. Look, I respect Miss Piggy, but whenever there's a Piggy episode, especially if there's a Piggy song, I would change the channel till the next episode. 
she's not my least favorite character, but it's always about her. This is number four, because though the character can be tiresome, I love the music. The lyrics are catchy, and the animation is fun to watch. So this may be the only Piggy song I can tolerate. Number 3. We Love Cartoons from the Great Muppet Cartoon Show. This is homage to all those who love cartoons as the Muppets put together their own cartoon animation. Not only do I love the song, but it's one of the episodes that inspired me to want to try animating something when I was little. Number 2. You're Special to Me from My Muppet Valentine. This is a sweet Valentine's episode where Nanny forgets to give Rolf his Valentine cookie. What's sweet about this episode is even though he was sad that he didn't get a cookie, instead of fretting, he wrote a song expressing his love for everyone despite not getting anything. That, my friend, is what love is all about. Maybe it was because dogs are always loyal no matter what. I don't know. But what I do know is that it did express how much he cares. And that's why this comes in second place. And the number one favorite Muppet Baby song is Someone's Gonna Fix It from By the Book. The Muppets read their favorite stories, taking us through their imagination. I love this song. It's upbeat, the animation is cute, and to this day, I still remember the lyrics by heart. Why? I don't know. It's a cheerful song, and there's no shame in it. We give it our best. The wise If you have a favorite song from the show, or even have a favorite top 10, please share by leaving a comment below. If you like this video and want to watch more, please like and subscribe and check out my channel. And stay tuned for more videos to come. Thanks for watching.